hello and welcome to this training course forex and binary trading getting started guide so before we get started i want to ask you a question all the claims that you see on facebook on different social media platforms and the testimonies that you hear from people that have made profits from trading forex or binary are they real well this is why you need to listen to this trading guide so you're actually in the right place number one if you want to learn about getting started with forex trading or binary trading or if you want to know how the process works of how one can actually deposit money and make some profit and actually get the money into their hands and also if you need to get going with trading maybe a friend has told you about trading and maybe someone has actually invited you to take a look at this forex trading and it's actually too good to ignore and some of these things are too good to be true but this guide is going to help you as a beginner to understand what's ahead you know there's a saying that goes to know the road ahead as those coming back now why should you listen to me by now you may be guessing who is this person who is talking to us who didn't introduce himself my name is kuda kwashi sapichuma i am based in zimbabwe i'm an internet marketer i have worked with a number of forex traders online forex traders i've also i've also i also participate in a number of binary and forex trading platforms for a number of years i kind of look at what people share and what they are talking about i do affiliate marketing for trading companies which i'm going to explain at the end of this training now i have actually hosted seminars in our country about forex trading and also i've hosted a number of online seminars and there's so much more that i've actually done i've worked with a number of people in the forex trading and space your biggest payoff from this training number one you actually know the best path to take and understand what you are actually jumping into you know there's a saying that says forewarned is forearmed you also get to know the tools to get started with you know a lot of people they've come to me and ask how do i get started with forex, forex trading and it's at the beginning of their journey they all have all these questions that they need answers for which are going to be answered here you understand how the process of forex trading takes even if you're actually a new beginner to forex trading and you actually avoid chances of actually getting scammed with forex trading and you actually also know the best forums to be part of so that you can learn and inter interact with others and there is so much more my gift for you just because you're actually listening to this training i have something very very special that i'm going to give if you stay to the end of this training a friend of mine let me tell you a story years back when i was actually looking for an extra way to make money i looked at my facebook friends and to check who is actually doing well and one of my friends was actually doing forex trading i approached him and i asked him okay can you please teach me how to make money from forex i spent some few days some few months at his house me sitting next to him he opened his computer for the first time i was amazed to see someone making huge profits in a very short space of time in less than an hour he had made this so much money i was like wow if i had known this earlier i would be making money but to be honest it wasn't that easy after he taught me what uh he had taught me i made a bit of profit and at the same time i lost the money you know but me spending time with my friend seeing the money that he was making and at the same time losing money at the same time um i realized that this person is a good gift that a lot of people out there needs so we went into a partnership and we decided to start up a forex trading online class okay which actually did very well it inspired a lot of people to start forex trading and i'm going to give you access to that training that my friend shared with me if you stay to the end of this training my friend showed me something that's amazing i sat next to him i saw what he was doing and 
that's what you're actually going to get access to and as i do this training you are going to be introduced to something that is known as bitcoin as one of the payment method that is going to be used that is, that is going to be mentioned in this training and maybe you're just a beginner in the uh you don't know what bitcoin is all about and i'm going to give you my special training i created a training about bitcoin which explains uh what bitcoin is all about so i'm going to mention in between uh as i go now are you ready to get started i'm sure you are ready now just because we'll be talking about money i just want to make this clear the examples that i'm going to give in this training in terms of money does not guarantee you that you're going to make money an individual success your success is determined by your desire your dedication your background your effort and motivation to work there is no guarantee that you have the same results that i'm going to mention here and also i'm not a financial advisor so please make sure that whatever we're going to be discussing here this involves money and there's an element of actually losing money which we're going to be discussing in this um in this training now are you up for a challenge having decided to take a look and consider forex trading it's not an easy path to take so what you need to do the first thing that you need to do is to get your mind ready get your mind in the right place if trading was easy everyone would be actually doing it you know there's a lot of testimonies that are actually shared on social media in different places and if it was easy everyone would be doing it everyone would be rich so you need to understand that you are maybe at a place where you are just beginning to do trading and your goal is to make profits your goal is to make money but that is not happening yet and you need to be patient you need to be disciplined so that the money can actually come you can lose money several times you can make a lot of money in the process so at the end of the day you're actually taking up a new challenge to learn new things and i understand the days that i was actually beginning you know i had internet connection problems i could understand how the markets were moving and so forth so this is a new challenge that you are taking and you should be ready for it okay now before i move on with my training let's take a look at what forex trading is all about i'm not going to cover all the other terminology that may confuse you at this point so let me give you an example the country that you are living in okay you use your local currency okay now let's say you're moving into another country if you're moving into another country if you convert your local currency to the country to the currency of the country that you are going to have actually participated in forex trading because you have actually changed uh, your local currency to another currency and when you're coming back to your country if you're going to exchange the other currency into your local currency you have actually participated in uh, forex trading so forex trading is in simple terms is just an exchange of a currency to another currency but when it comes to online trading uh, when it comes to online trading you'll be doing it online as a professional now who trades forex you may be asking so one of the uh, these banks they trade forex companies investors and at the same time individuals just like you and me we are allowed to actually participate in uh, forex trading and there are so many entities that actually um trade forex now let's talk about the risk and the rewards i understand a lot of people i've spoken to a lot of people you know when they are actually coming to me they have got this approach that whenever you invest money into forex <laughs> the next thing that you're gonna do is to make money yet they overlook the risk they only look at the rewards now there is a risk of losing all your money there is a risk of actually making profits and lots of profits forex can be traded in any country 24 7 okay i'm going to be explaining some of the uh, days whereby people trade forex and uh why i mentioned as well uh 24 7. so understand the risk and the rewards as well you can lose there's a huge potential of losing all your money there's a huge potential of making money now 
trading knowledge where does one find trading knowledge number one if you are anything like me you can actually find a coach like what i did okay i actually looked at my facebook friends and to check who is actually doing well okay and i found a coach i sat next to him he showed me what he showed me and at the same time i had to learn from a coach okay so number one you can actually find a coach and i would say not everyone out there uh is very good at forex trading let me explain this when you're actually getting to a coach okay you're not getting to a person who's going to make you rich okay you're going to get to a person who's going to show you the fundamentals the basic foundation and then you build from the foundation because at the end of the day a lot of people they have a perspective that if they are looking at a forex trader they are looking at this millionaire guy they are looking at this guy who is rich <laughs> they are looking at this guy who never lacks money they are looking at this guy who never loses trades okay even the professionals in forex trading they lose money they have their ups and downs so what you need to focus on basically is the knowledge and the foundation that someone is going to teach you because at the end of the day you're actually learning something new you can actually learn from the free resources on the internet there is quite a lot of resources on the internet about forex trading and one of them is called investopedia.com the other one is babypeeps.com there you actually learn uh, some basic information about forex trading and also you can actually pay for an online course myself after finding a coach i also paid for an online course that i went through that helped me understand better uh, forex there are many places where you can actually get courses there is udemy.com that's u d e m y dot com you can actually find forex and binary trading uh courses there i highly recommend that you take note of the knowledge aspect and now as we move on to the steps of actually um the guide i want to talk about the green lock on any website this training course speaks about depositing money into some websites at one point so this is a process whereby money will be moved from your bank to the website and from the website to your bank and sometimes with the scams you also need to check on the if you look on a website any kind of website okay like for an example uh let's talk of the famous uh, websites like facebook if you check if you go on the computer if you check you see a green lock before the http what that green lock is actually a security lock that says uh, that means the information that you're putting there is very secure no one can actually um, look at it okay so let's say you are adding your credit card details to your website you always have to check that green lock that it's there okay it means whatever details that you're going to enter there they are very safe and no one is actually can actually um, scam your credit card or your bank or something like that so you always have to uh check for that and most of the websites that takes money they all have um those locks so you can actually check the locks uh right where i mentioned now how to participate in forex trading the first thing that you need to participate in forex trading is a broker okay now let's look at a broker as as uh, let me explain define what a broker is a broker is a place where or companies or an entity whereby you deposit the money that you need to trade forex and then you go to the platforms to trade forex uh, and then when you make profit the money is deposited is is, is 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 traded on your broker's account and then you withdraw something like that that's that's how the process works now let me give you an example of 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 a broker in simple terms let's take of sports betting okay that's the very good example that i can actually give if you look at sports betting whereby you're actually predicting that team a is going to win uh team b is going to lose okay so if you're doing sports betting that means um okay let's look at sports betting with a friend okay your friend 
your friend is saying team B is going to win and you're saying team 1A is going to win, okay? But there's going to be trust issues, okay? If your friend is going to say, okay, I'll keep my money, or your friend is saying, I'll keep the money, and then when you win, I'm going to give you all the money, okay? You can get into a conflict at the end of the day if your friend loses. They can say, wow, well, I was just trying my luck. I'm not going to give you your money and stuff like that. So in instead, you decide to add another friend, a third friend that you're going to say, okay, uh, I'm saying team A is going to win and he's saying team B is going to win, but we are all going to give you our money, okay? When we give you our money, at the end of the match, whichever team wins, you give them all the money, okay? So at the end of the day, you're trusting <laughs> your other friend that is going to deliver the money at the end of the day. So if you look at that, the other friend that you invited is actually the broker where you actually deposit the money, you trade the money, and then when you make profit, you take the money. When you lose, you lose. Okay. So examples of brokers that I use most is number one, binary.com, and there's hotforex.com, iqoptions.com, which is binary.com is B I N A R Y dot com hot forex is h o t f o r e x dot com iq options is i q o p t i o n s dot com there are so many brokers out there so many so many i cannot mention them i just mentioned here the brokers that i actually um use now the most famous broker that i use my favorite is binary.com and um, i'm going to mention a few reasons why i love binary.com um the most okay my I, I i use different brokers like the ones that i've mentioned okay the three are the main common ones that i actually use now the number one reason i love about binary.com is it has different payment methods okay what i mean by different payment method is you can wire money there you can use bitcoin you can use screw you can use uh Nutella, you can use different payment methods okay to deposit money into that broker and there is education offered on that platform okay what i mean by education offered on that platform is they've got ebooks they've got getting started guide they've got everything you need to get going and they have great support if you actually jump into anything that you don't understand you can actually send them a support ticket they are very quick in response and they've got webinars on their website and they also um, post a number of videos on their website and they one of the trading platform that i love about this is mt4 and mt5 which they introduced recently so um the trading platform mt5 is whereby you'll be seeing candles okay you'll be seeing the price movement if you're trading us dollars against um british pound you'll be seeing the price movement for like um, a month a year 30 minutes two hours that's the empty mt4 platform or mt5 platform mt5 is the latest mt4 is just um, behind mt5 so they offer binary options they offer forex trading they also offer cryptocurrency okay uh cryptocurrency trading. there is also volatility uh trading as well now when i explain that you can trade 24 7 when it comes to forex trading it's actually traded from monday to friday and volatility is 24 7 that you can actually um trade so again binary.com has got all these lessons on binary on forex on cryptocurrency volatility you just have to be patient to understand how everything works so now there is so much more that they offer but i just wanted to give you a brief um look at what this company is is all about and i withdraw my money with no issues now creating an account with a broker creating an account with a broker is very easy you actually choose a broker of yourself and make sure you've got an account an email account that's actually working so all you need to do is actually to visit a broker of your choice like myself i use binary.com and follow the steps of actually creating an account and creating an account is free you don't pay any money when you are creating an account and you should also know that 
at times maybe the broker can actually call you after just creating an account just to that's part of their marketing or support okay just to make sure that what is your intention on creating the account do you want to lend do you want to help depositing funds don't be surprised if you are getting calls from a broker because some of the people that i actually approached some of the people have actually approached me and said you know i just got a call from this company and they are asking me uh this and that i'm just not trusting them okay it's just part of their support system okay so you just have to be open enough to tell them okay i'm actually new i don't understand this okay uh you can just ask any question that you want so after you create an account it's free like i said but there's something that you need to understand is the kyc policy okay this process can be annoying at times but it's very very important that you do this so most of the companies that you're going to deposit money to okay like the brokers like the payment methods they have what is known as kyc policy kyc policy simply means know your client policy okay and if you don't do this process you're going to have challenges with drawing your money okay so know your client policy is done by uploading your passport your id or your driver's license and your proof of residence to the company or to the broker so that they approve your account for um it's either you use the account with some limitations if you're not approved so if you get approved you'll be unlocking uh most of the features on the website which i highly recommend that you get your account approved so the process can be annoying sometimes you may not scan your documents properly sometimes they ask you to take a picture of yourself hold your id next to you and like uh take a picture you upload so if you can't do that yourself you can actually look for an it person someone who understands it so that they can help you do the the process it's something that you have to do just once and then when you're doing once your account is actually uh Good to go now after creating an account before you trade into in a real account the most brokers they offer what is known as a demo account a demo account is whereby you they give you practice money you don't deposit anything they give you the account and after going through the lessons remember from the first time i said get a coach after going through the lessons if you need to practice what you are actually learning or what you are actually doing you go to the demo account and the demo account has money in it and you can actually whatever you do there is something that you can actually do in a real account so stay in the demo account as much as possible until you're confident to try things out okay a lot of people like i said in the beginning many people they are ready for the rewards but they are not ready for the risks okay so make sure you are ready to uh practice and practice and practice and practice on the demo account and move on to the real account on a later stage now talking about the real account when you are ready that is okay and how long does it take for someone to be in the real account well it depends on you some other people they take a year some other people they are too fast they take a day it really depends up to you i cannot decide for you so the first thing that you need to do for the real account is to deposit funds i'm going to tell you the process of depositing funds okay and then you trade okay when you trade it's either you make profit or you make a loss okay when you make profit that is everyone swish uh you withdraw your money and make sure your account is verified because most of the brokers they won't deposit the money into your account if your account is not verified so let me just explain the process of uh payment method so if you're going to choose any broker okay if you're going to choose any broker the first thing that you need to check there is what is the payment method do they use to deposit what is the payment method do they use to withdraw the money okay so depending from country to country where i live uh I cannot easily use the bank to do the process okay so my preference my best preference is bitcoin or screw okay that's what i prefer okay um, i'm not saying go for that <laughs> but if you have other means you can actually test things out i was actually sitting 
with a gentleman one of these days and he was asking me that um you know what i need to, to, to do this binary thing i need to do this trading and i was like he was like okay i have good one thousand us dollars okay so i need to do everything and i said you know what why not take twenty dollars from the from the from the one thousand that you have and practice with that twenty dollars deposit the money do whatever you do make some losses make some profits withdraw the money make sure that the money is back in your hands and then you can do the other things that you need to do with the 980 dollars that is left okay so you know a lot of people they would did this tendency that if they are going to start they start big okay they start big with a lot of money and you know i cannot recommend anyone to test out these things with a thousand dollars i have to be honest with you okay test out with five dollars test out with ten dollars it's it can work okay it will ten dollars is good for you to can to actually move the money there bring it back move it bring it back and stuff like that okay so let's look at uh screw for starters okay so if you're using screw you need a visa card okay the first thing that you need to do is to go to screw.com you create an account there so remember we're going to use the screw platform to send the money to the broker okay so you go to screw.com you create an account okay and you're going to need a visa card what a visa card all you need to do is to go to the bank okay there are different banks you ask the bank that do you offer a visa card they give you the visa card you deposit money into the visa card when you deposit money into visa card you go back to your screw account and you connect your screw account to visa okay when you connect your screw account to visa money is going to be moved from from your visa and it goes to sit into your screw account once it sit in your screw account it goes to the broker okay and you're going to see the money in your broker's account if it's ten dollars if it's a thousand you're going to see it there and then you trade okay and make sure when you're actually on screw you do the same verification process because screw is got what is known as kyc policy you upload your passport your proof of residence and is it safe to use screw yes it is safe a lot of people they use screw for different purposes it's actually a payment method just like paypal just like Nutella, just like um uh other payment methods and it's actually easy to use and you can use screw to deposit money into into your broker and withdraw money into your broker so this is how it works remember the example that i've actually given you the friend your friend and your friend a and your friend b and your friend c okay your friend c is the one who is holding the money and in this case your friend c is the broker okay so you deposit money into your broker and to do this process you need a mediator here which is screw okay or a bank deposit which depending with the country that you are in so money is going to be deposited in the broker when you make profit you can actually withdraw the money into your screw account and then it goes back to your visa card okay let me just <laughs> redraw this okay this is the visa card okay this is the visa i'll say this is the visa okay and this is your bank let me just draw the bank okay i just want to make sure that you understand this process now okay and um now let's see we have the visa the money goes to your skrill account okay after the visa and then the money goes to the broker okay and then you trade you make profits you make close the money goes from your broker when you make a profit it goes to your skrill account from a skrill it goes to visa and from visa it goes to the bank and then you draw the the money that's the process that's how it works now let's talk about bitcoin if you're using bitcoin basically uh you don't have to do the kyc policy okay and you need to learn how to use bitcoin it's a little bit difficult as compared to screw screw is actually straightforward okay and screw actually on the website screw.com they offer support on if you have any issues but when it comes to uh bitcoin you'll be on your own 
okay and with bitcoin you've got actually freedom of payment you can actually pay as much money as you want as compared to screw and with bitcoin you don't have to do the kyc policy there's no verification needed you can just log in with the email and then that's it and then you can use bitcoin to deposit money into your broker and withdraw money from a broker that's what i use so i, I recommend that you use screw okay and like i said in the beginning that i have a gift for you okay and since bitcoin is maybe something new to you i'm actually going to give you a training course that i've actually done and i charge for this training okay it's not free but just because you are listening to this training i'm going to give it to you for free so you can visit the website kudaonline.com forward slash learn bitcoin you'll be able to create your account there so it's www.kudaonline.com forward slash learn bitcoin i'm going to repeat that again www.kudaonline.com c o m slash forward slash l e a r n b i t c o i n okay so there you're going to be learning about about bitcoins and how you can actually uh use them so this training is actually separate from this these uh the bitcoin training it covers a whole lot about understanding uh about understanding bitcoin now what is needed to get started with forex trading the first thing that you need definitely is internet connection and very very good internet connection okay the second thing that you need is a mobile phone or a computer i prefer doing this on a computer for the first time okay if you're doing trading for the first time i prefer that you learn all the things on the computer and when you become very good at it you can actually use a mobile phone because you understand uh how it works because on a mobile phone the screen is a little bit smaller and the number three thing that you need is knowledge a course or a coach okay it all is a combination of all this okay if, if you take a look at this i did not say you need money okay to get going i said internet connection a computer a course knowledge or a coach okay and then the money is something that will then the money will happen okay and then later on you need some small setup capital to actually do things in the real uh account now let's look at forex scams I, like i said i've been in this for a very long time and i'm going to talk about some of my experiences on how people lost money through forex scams okay so they are whatsapp groups they are you know I, I belong to this whatsapp group of people that are trading forex and you know so whenever they see someone saying okay we are trading on your behalf give us the money we'll give you 20 percent per day 100 percent per month 100 percent per week whichever it is so the charts are always coming to our whatsapp group and people are just laughing ah, ha, ha. it's only going to be one day when all those investors are actually going to lose their money if you go to any expect forex trader they don't give anyone money to trade on their behalf okay it's actually a time bomb it's actually going to explode anytime hence you lose money so i've seen that happening and there's actually um bogus brokers okay so whereby you actually uh deposit money into your broker and they are not 100 percent legit and you lose money i've experienced that scam investors so um i have a friend of mine who had invested for at this company okay online as well and they were saying that they trade forex okay and when they trade forex they give you returns and all that and it's something that i've experienced people losing money fake robots okay so when it comes to forex trading there is robots okay they are they are softwares that are designed to trade on your behalf and some of them they are not genuine so people hence lose money scam signals and when i'm talking about scam signals you know when it comes to forex trading there's a time whereby you don't need to look at the charts you just need to know the entry point and the exit point so there are services that offer those signals and some of them they are not 100 percent so the process is like someone will be sending you some signals and you'll be doing those signals in your account 
and hence you can actually uh, lose some money and so on this if you go on facebook there's people who say you know what thank god for this fund manager who managed my account i made ten thousand in a day i made this much we can also help you give us some money and we'll trade on your behalf and stuff like that okay i've actually seen uh something like that happening i'm going to give you resources if you want to go that route i've i just have two places that i can recommend from this that i've seen working and yeah i'm going to give you at the end of this training so now let's look at the frequent asked question how much can i make per month from forex trading now look when it comes to forex trading you don't make money per month okay it's only that people that go to work who get paid per month okay you're not going to work when you become a forex trader you're becoming an entrepreneur okay and entrepreneur is entrepreneurs are paid as per results okay so the higher profit that you make the more money you make okay so you get paid as per result you can make money in a day you can make money in a week you can make money in a month you can make money in a year some i know long traders who trade for a year okay they leave their trades for a year and and, and take the profits after a year and one of the things is forex legit illegal or legal let's talk about that so if you look at it um uh every website that a broker in fact they also have a page of legal uh page whereby they explain about the legalities so you can actually go through that but in my opinion forex trading yes you can actually do forex trading there are people who are doing forex trading silently okay because this is an online thing you just need internet connection and your knowledge and your money that's it now how much do i need to start okay like i said earlier on if you are new to forex trading you just need to start small okay 10 20 dollars learn the steps learn how it works and then you can actually decide how much you need to to put in okay so it depends with you now can i use robots for trading basically okay the most people that i have known that do trading they use what is known as price action so if you're going to learn about price action i think you become a very good um, trader I, I've, I haven't come across any robots that are really really good but price action is the one of the best now can i trust someone to trade on my behalf okay like i said earlier on um based on my opinion i don't think i don't recommend you do that especially on the very 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 early stages you rather trade on your own and uh, see how things work now get social okay what i mean by get social be part of discussions ask questions like uh okay i'm deciding to, i'm thinking of taking this route is this the best idea so i want to talk about a website that is called itoro.com now itoro.com think of facebook as a social network for interacting with other people but when you look at itoro.com we are looking at a social media platform for forex traders okay and at itoro like i said earlier on um is there a place that i can recommend whereby you can deposit money and they trade on your behalf you can find that platform at itoro okay or itoro offers that and another platform that offers that is called hotforex.com one of the brokers that i've actually mentioned earlier on now it itoro is e t o r o dot com that's the social network and then you can actually also become part of whatsapp groups of people in your area okay people that you know like and trust and actually ask some questions now like i promised earlier on that i'm going to give you a training that my friend the person who spoke to me about trading i'm going to give you free access to that okay so um the training is called zimbinarytraders.com it's z i m b i n a r y t r a d e r s dot com zim binary traders.com that's where you can actually find the training that a good friend of mine show, shared with me about about um forex trading so in my conclusion 
Okay, before I actually do the conclusion, yeah, uh, I, I want to talk about, like I said earlier on, I'm an affiliate marketer for some of the brokers. You can actually become a broker. You can actually become an affiliate with a broker. So how this works is you actually recommend someone to to a broker. Okay, you just say maybe, okay, if you want to do trading, go to binary.com or go to hot forex. And if you do that, you actually get paid, okay? Because you're actually directing customers to them. So I do that on the internet. So if you look at maybe an example of binary.com, if you look at the bottom page of binary.com, you see where it says affiliate program. And where it says affiliate program right there is where you find the details to promote a broker and get paid some commission. So you don't really have to do anything. All you have to do is just use your mouth or use your mouth or use some of the platforms like facebook whatsapp to recommend that broker and as you do that you actually get paid that's how i get paid as an affiliate marketer like, like i explained uh earlier on now in my conclusion forex trading is definitely not for everyone and can someone make money in forex trading yes you can actually make money at the same time you can lose money so you need to understand that you need patience you need discipline and of course a plan okay with that being said we've actually come to the end of this training so my aim was just to provide the basic steps in the uh the basic foundation of getting started with forex trading especially to my good friends in zimbabwe i reside in zimbabwe and a lot of people they come to me with all these questions that i've actually tried to explain uh on this training course so if i didn't answer some of your questions i know there's a lot to cover with uh with forex trading and binary trading please feel free to reach out to me on my facebook i'm actually very active on facebook my facebook is facebook dot com forward slash kuda online or you can actually check out my website which is kuda online dot com with that being said ladies and gentlemen i wish you all the success and i look forward to hearing your success story soon bye for now